as it stands right now, what Republican wins Iowa as you see it? Uh, you know, I think there's a reasonable chance that Ted Cruz will come along and, and steal Iowa. I know he's not at the top of the list right now, uh, but he's got the endorsement of Steve King, the, that obscenely anti-immigrant, anti-immigration, anti-Hispanic congressman. Uh, and I think as a lot of evangelicals begin to have second thoughts, and I'm talking about conservative evangelicals, because, by the way, we use the term too loosely. There are plenty of liberal evangelicals as well. But as long as those kind of really hard-right religious voters, uh, the longer they look at Carson, I think the more doubts they're going to have. And the easiest place for them to go uh, is probably Ted Cruz. It's a race against the calendar for Bernie Sanders to uh, garnish more African-American and and, uh, people of color support in this country. Uh, It's a heavy lift, there's no doubt, but he has gained uh, in the last month some 16 points. What do you make of that? Well, look, I think that that there is some resistance by a considerable number of people in the Democratic Party to uh, anointing Hillary Clinton as the nominee. I think Bernie Sanders is speaking to some concerns that Democrats have that run very deep. And by the way, it's not just Democrats who are worried, for example, about the influence of special interest money in the process uh, or how we're going to deal with the big banks. So I think he's got that appeal, and Mm -hmm. I think it's a very strong appeal. Uh, The communities of color don't really know him. They don't know, for example, that he was involved in the civil rights movement from almost the very beginning. And they also really like Hillary Clinton. They always have. They were with her at this point in the process, even against Barack Obama in 2008. It was only when he started winning in Iowa and New Hampshire, and then they moved to him in South Carolina and moved to him kind of decisively across the country. That is, African Americans did. So it's, it's an, it, look, he says it himself. If it were held today, he would lose. It's an uphill battle. I think it's likely that Hillary Clinton, very likely Hillary Clinton, is going to be the nominee. And when that happens, anybody who cares about a progressive future in this country is, in my view, obligated to go out there and fight for her. Bob Shrum, all good. How's life? I haven't talked to you for a while. Life's great. I'm out here in California. Weather's nice. I think it was like 75 today, although it's going to cool off, Ed. It's going to cool off to like 58 on Thanksgiving Day. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving, my friend. Eat Happy all the turkey, turkey in the you. world. You bet. Nice, okay, th- nice to visit. Bob Shrub, Democratic strategist, longtime friend of me and our work.